All right, so I've got another overlay for you, and this time it's animated overlays. Uh, I think we've covered all of them now, so let's just have a look. Really what we're bringing on here, the animated overlays are little video files, little video clips that uh, have just got movement in them. So we're using this really with uh, a little lower third. So Owen made this one for me, and uh, in it comes, brings my name up, and actually I can resize this. I don't want it that big. Let me just pull that back and just pause it when it's there. Let's just see, we want it about that size there. So I can just pop this to the bottom and I can tell it to hide when it's finished. Uh, so that will attach itself to this scene. So when I come onto this scene, this overlay will pop up. Okay, so a really nice way to do something like that. It could be a simpler one. Let's drag it into current scene and it says to me, do I want to add it as an animated overlay or as a video? So let's say animated overlay. I can just stretch this out to fit the width of it. This is one that we made in a previous academy, uh, very quickly and crudely, but yeah, anything like that. You know, if you like the idea of just, um, we can set this one. What I need to do is just uh, get to the controls so I can loop this. So this one is just um, and hit play. So it's just having this little movement going on down here while my live's on. Uh, it's something very simple that I just knocked up in Canva. So a couple of ways of doing that. Basically something that's got some movement. Uh, it could be a frame, it could be a border, it could be little snowdrops coming down, things like that. Snowdrops, snowflakes coming down. Uh, so yeah, but you don't get audio with it. Now while we're just on the topic of animated overlays, technically it doesn't fit that box, but uh, what we can now bring in is WebM files. And uh, by converting your video file across to a WebM file, I can drag it on here, and it will now play this as an animated overlay, but with audio. So this is a, a real plus for this kind of thing. If you wanted something like this where you've got a, a, a video playing over the front but you want the audio to come with it, uh, you can now do that as a WebM overlay. And as you can see, it comes up here as a video file in your overlays. So there's another one that you can go away, have a play with, see what you come up with, and uh, why don't you let us know.